Well, like, I first picked up a DSLR camera I think I was 21 years old. So I always had some pictures online with different crazy shots and, yeah, yeah. you know, so travel, horrible travel Photoshop yeah. editing. Yeah, we all did. <laughs> <laughs> we all did, right? Yeah. <laughs> crazy. A friend of mine, he was already into the business. He was doing uh, videography. So he thought that, you know, maybe he saw some potential in me and he asked me if I can go to, to this wedding. Uh, he just literally put the camera in my hands with no instructions, yeah, yeah. no explanations. <laughs> How to use this? What is the project? Um, yeah, it just it just went for it, and I'm here because of him. Maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So you, you never know who you can influence in your life. In 2012, right after I, I bought my first camera, it was a D700 that I still have. I'm not gonna sell that camera, never. <laughs> it's, like, you know, it's like first love, you, you, can't, you can't forget that. <laughs> you are sentimental, man. I am <laughs> probably too sentimental. It's like Jonas Peterson uh, told us at uh, Way Up North uh, last year. Sometimes the weddings are not about a couple. They're definitely not about you as a photographer. Yeah, that's right. Sometimes the weddings are not even the people who are there. Sometimes they're about people who are not there. Some other photographers that I drew inspiration from is um, Jordan Vaught. He's a great image composer. It's Benj Haish, especially because he's a Christian too. And I, I love following people who are having the same values and principles. Yeah. As I have, and yeah. I think that's that's important. So I, I brought I, I picked up my camera and I went to Thailand to take some sunrise shots. And um, I saw this lonely man on the beach. I went next to him and started to talk, you know, just having a conversation, which actually lasted for two hours. And I, I remember he he told me something like when when he heard that I, I want to be, become a photographer, he told me that um, behind every image behind every portrait there is a story waiting mm. waiting to be cherished and, and wow. celebrated that stuck with me until now it's like yeah every every person you meet every couple you meet it doesn't matter you know where you are or what level of um, you know on, on society you are yeah there's a story waiting there you know waiting to come out what keeps you going when you doubt your skills as a photographer I don't know. <laughs> just push it through. Yeah, just try not to think about it. Yeah, not seriously now. When, because I have a lot of moments when I when I doubt my skills. It's like what I was doing when I was high in the mountains in, in the Himalayas when I just couldn't walk anymore. And I was right. so tired. I always look behind me to see how far I've come. Wow. That's really good. And yeah. that really uh, pushed me to make another step. Yes. And another step is like you know slow steps, baby steps, Amazing. that's what pushes you forward. When I doubt my skills, I, I look behind it at the previous work that I've done, Yeah. and I'm like, I'm not that bad as I think I am. Oh, that is <laughs> so good. Yeah. You have no idea how far you can get if you just stay humble. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> if you are confident in yourself, in your abilities. Yeah. yeah. Uh, my success can be so different than your success. Yeah. When I get that, phone call or FaceTime call from a couple hundred miles away yeah. with tears in, an, in their eyes. Seriously, just think about it. You just participate in other people's lives and you make them happy. Yeah. It's yeah. It's not an easy job to capture you know, no. the most important thing for people. No. So it doesn't matter if you're shooting a wedding or just an engagement session or an elopement or a baby shoot or something. It's for them, it's one of the most precious things. So yeah. if you learn how to nail that job and come back home on the wrong direction just because you're feeling so grateful, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. it's... <laughs> yeah. Yes, they're happy and you're happy. Yeah. And, wow.